This is the Joe is Hungry channel. I'm at my local Subway in Fairmount, Georgia, and today I'm gonna check out their new barbecue rib sandwich. Now it's time for the moment of truth. I've got my barbecue rib sandwiches. Before we go any further, it's time to do the Joe is Hungry temperature test. This thing clocks in at only 101.6 degrees. It could be a lot warmer, it's not. Now that we have our temperature, it's time to head on to the studios of Joe is Hungry, located in my adopted hometown of Fairmount, Georgia. Today, Subway finally has a new product release. They call it the barbecue rib sandwich. This sandwich is made up of a rib-shaped pork patty, sweet barbecue sauce, lettuce, onions, pickles, and your choice of bread. Today, I used Italian because that's what it was in the ad on the website. At my local Subway, and I do stress my local Subway because prices vary wildly from Subway to Subway. The six inch in Fairmount will set you back $3.89. The foot long will set you back $5.99. I have price ranging anywhere from $8 for a foot long clear down to five, and that's all within a 30 mile radius of where I'm sitting. Subway needs to work on their pricing and compliance between Subway to Subway. As you saw on the temperature test, it wasn't very warm. It was probably one of the least warmest pieces of food that I've done yet. I'm not worried about it being fresh. I know they microwaved it to order, but the toaster oven wasn't warmed up when I came in, and I was the first customer. I'll give them that much credit. So after my sandwich was cooked, I had to wait 10 minutes for the toaster oven to warm up before they can even hit it. The residual heat that you saw was just from the toaster oven because my sandwich had already assumed room temperature. That being said, now it's time to move on to the Joe is Hungry weight test. The six inch sub weighs in at 8.8 ounces. Subway says it's supposed to weigh 7.3 ounces. The 12 inch weighs 15.65 ounces. Their stated serving weight is 14.6 ounces. Subway, you knocking it out of the park on weight? You're slightly at or above your stated serving weight. The next thing we have to do is the big reveal. This is what it looks like, and this it is what it's supposed to look like. This is what it looks like, and this is what it's supposed to look like. We've seen how much it weighed, we've seen what it looks like. Now it's time for the one and only Joe is Hungry bite test. Bite test, engage. their barbecue sauce. I like their bread. I always like the Italian bread, even though it kind of flattens out and looks smaller than it should be. The pickles work well with it. I could have had a little bit more barbecue sauce on there. I like their sweet barbecue sauce. I think it's the same stuff they used on the brisket sandwich, which worked a whole lot better than this did. The little pressed pork patty doesn't really have a lot of flavor. Let me take a piece on its own. Not really a lot of flavor and doesn't look very appetizing. Could use a little more seasoning, and I'm not really even sure that would help it. I would have been real curious to see how it did on its test marketing back in 1999. Kinda makes me wonder whether they had all these patties in a freezer somewhere and had to figure out some way of getting rid of them by making a limited time offer. If they're trying to compete with McDonald's McRib, they're failed. 
I guess I need to come up with a score for this thing. Let me see. If you don't know what my scale is, it's printed in the description. Is this thing in the nines? No way. Is this thing in the eights? Would you travel for it? Would you take your wife to dinner to eat one of these? Not unless you want to get killed in your sleep. Is this a seven? I'm going to say probably not. I'm going to have to go with a 5.1. Not enough to fall down the slippery slopes to food hell, but not far from the edge. That's my review. If you found this interesting, if you found this useful, subscribe to the channel, support the channel, and we will see you in the next video. The absence of the sun.